For Childhood Cancer Awareness Month, we're taking this week to showcase the specific care only happening at Children's of Alabama. Today we're featuring a specific blood disorder that hits the CBS 42 family close to home. Meet Jasmine Foster. CBS 42, this is Jasmine. How may I help you? Our CBS 42 receptionist that greets everyone with a smile. No Thank you. Her positive, friendly attitude is contagious. <laughs> Jasmine's son Mason is equally as joyful and full of life as his mother. Mason lives with sickle cell disease, an inherited blood disorder. He doesn't see it as I'm sick all the time. He doesn't look at it in a bad light. Jasmine explains that Mason's blood cells look like crescent moons when they're supposed to be shaped like donuts. So they're sticky, they're pointy, and they get stuck when they're supposed to be flowing. It causes excruciating pain on levels that you can't even explain. At four years old, Mason had his first crisis. He couldn't even sit down. He had to have a blood transfusion. Since his diagnosis at six days old, Mason has been lovingly cared for at Children's of Alabama. Each year in Alabama, 50 children are born with sickle cell. Things like sickle cell are closer to home than you think. You know, it's a blood disease. There's no cure for sickle cell disease. So in our 18 year old population, we have 900 patients with sickle cell that we care for. We have a very large team to take care of these children. We also have a large support program. They are welcoming, they are warm, and anytime we have to spend the night, they make sure he feels comfortable. I don't know, they just make it feel like home even though it shouldn't be home. And they make you feel okay with your situation. So I love children's. So research going on at UAB and Children's of Alabama are finding new ways to cure our patients. So right now we have therapies that make their lives better, but our goal here at Children's of Alabama is to find a cure for these children. To learn more about the treatment that children like Mason are receiving at Children's of Alabama, visit childrensal.org slash committed to a cure. For CBS 42 Living Local, I'm Lillian Lalo.